Hey, it's Jay Calderon with 12rounder.com, and I'm here to give you the quick picks for this weekend's upcoming fights. Fairly busy schedule, not a lot of genuine pick 'em fights, at least on paper, but that being said, there's a couple of interesting contests that'll be taking place. On the 15th, Saturday, of course, in Dublin at the 3 Arena, you'll be seeing middleweight Matthew Macklin taking on Jorge Sebastian Highland. Um, I'm predicting in this situation, Macklin will be picking up the victory somewhere around the middle of the fight. He'll probably be a little sharp, the crowd re reaction, everything like that. He's had some time off. He's had some time to recover some from some setbacks, recent losses, things like that, and he'll wear him down. Uh, Calga 5 will be taking on Everth Brasino, I believe is how you say his name. I think it's quick. I'm big on Cal. I think he probably takes him out within three or four rounds. And the same can go for Sam Eggington against Sebastian Alace, I believe, or Alias. I have no clue how to say his name, but that being said, I believe Egg Eggington takes him apart. You can also check out the quick pick for Vladimir Klitschko versus Kubrat Pulev in the description below. Um, I'm picking Vladimir Klitschko in that fight, but you can take a more detailed look at the fight and my breakdown of that fight in the description again below in a link. And uh, in Cancun, we'll be seeing Christian... Miharis taking on Lester Medrano. I'm picking Miharis because if he has anything left, he should win a decision. If he does not, then Medrano, a guy who's certainly no world beater, will clearly put him up against it at the very least and potentially win. But I'm still going with Miharis. Also on that same card, Yuri Arcus Gamboa will be taking on his first opponent since his first loss as a professional. He'll be taking on Joel Montes de Oca, the, the Oca I believe is how you say his name. I'm a expecting Gambo to still be explosive and quick enough to earn a TKO, but again, after that first loss, a lot of times opponents try to come out, try to test your chin, see if they can do the same thing, and him coming off the loss to Terrence Crawford could make the fight a bit more interesting, but I'm still going with Gambo in the comeback fight. And in South Africa, we have Thomas Usuthin. Usuthin, I'm sorry, uh, should be able to take care of Dennis Grachev. Now, if he is not at least something that a lot of people expected him to be, at least some part of that, then Grotch is the sort of fighter that could potentially expose him. But I, I'm going to go with him based solely on some of the things that I saw and some of the belief that people had him in him early on in his career. But again, if he's not that guy, if he's not taking it seriously, then it's not going to happen, and I would easily be... I would easily see, rather, uh, Grachev taking him out, potentially stopping him, or wearing him down and winning a fairly comfortable decision, or at least deserving one. But I'll go with Thomas in this fight, even though I could see it going either way for a couple of reasons. Anyway, what are your picks? Love to hear them. Tell me about them, and uh, leave them in the comments section, or of course, hit me up on Twitter at 12 Rounder Boxing, and like, comment, share, subscribe, all that great stuff, and until next time, enjoy the fights.